Are we ready to roll? Archer is a rescued Arabian stallion who's dangerous to handle. These horses, they get governed by hormones only. If they are full stallions, you cannot turn your back oh. on them. Oh, 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 it's OK. It's OK. Dr. Pohl has to sedate Archer to handle him safely. Where did you get him? South of Flint. Lady rescued him. He ended up just in the wrong hands with a bunch of other stallions, low man on the totem pole. The slowest he's ever backed out. <laughs> easy, easy. Good boy. Corinne wants to castrate Archer so he becomes more docile. There, nicely on the high, dry spot. The very first year that I came here, 30 some years ago, there had not been a veterinarian for many years that castrated horses. And I remember in that summer, I castrated probably 60 horses. Another shot knocks him out for the procedure. When I give the second shot and the horse will lay down, I tell people to get out of the way. We have no idea which way they fall. And OK, everybody watch out, step aside. But the horse falls sideways. And that's why I am in front. I'm hanging on to him. And tell people, you know, stand behind me is the best. That's the safest. Going to sleep. Yep. It's the calmest this horse has oh, ever been. There he goes. How long have you had him? <laughs> I've had Archer for a week. They didn't have any money to castrate the horse, and he just needed it. <sighs> What's the saying? Take the balls out so the brains come back? Shut up, Charles. There's a lady here. <laughs> yes, you take the balls out, the brains come back. And it is true. Oh, God. Looks like very uncomfortable. If you've never seen a castration before, it can take you aback. It's making me cringe. <laughs> I cut through the skin both times. I get the testicles out, and then I cut out the skin in between. Ooh, got a squirter. Oh, disgusting. <laughs> Did it get you? Yeah. <laughs> and that'll just heal up on its own? Always does. A horse like this, one day rest, when he's a little sore, he doesn't fight you as hard. So work with him, break him, and make a horse out of him. There we go. I learned that just let them get it by themselves, that they have their feet underneath them. Oh. They don't fall. <laughs> they don't hurt themselves. When they get up, they're ready to get up and they walk away. OK, you think you can walk? <laughs> I Let's don't go. know. <laughs> the little one's sure there. He's like, OK, where's my feet? What happened? <laughs> Easy, buddy. I told Cran after the castration, she'll see a big change in Archer. He'll be much easier to deal with, and on, he'll be a good riding horse. Oh, I want to go home. He'll change his attitude, because the hormones are gone. Done and done. You geld them, they become a whole different horse. They listen, and that's it. Good. Cool. You'll like him. He's going to be a nice horse. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 